All right, let's program how to find the area of a trapezoid. So you're going to go under Program, New, and this is in caps lock right now. We need to name the program. So we're gonna name it Area, and the keys are in alphabetical order. So Area, Trap, and if at any point you need to, you could pause the video if I'm going faster than you are. So Area, Trap. Um, first thing we need to do is ask the someone to prompt, like put in what they need to put in. So you're going to go to program and then go over to I.O. and that's where we find display. So this is what we can ask the user to put in. And then just to make it easy or on us, we're going to do second alpha to put the alpha lock on. And then whenever you want something to be displayed on the screen, need to put it in quotation marks. So we're going to do a quotation base. The space is the zero key. One. And then I did the alpha lock again. Um, space is. And then we're going to go again. We need to ask for now them to put the information in, which is prompt. And when it, you do prompt, it's gonna um, put a question mark. You'll see in a minute when we go through it. So base two, so I wanna do alpha. We're gonna set that to variable B. Now we need to ask for base two. So we're gonna display again. And now we need to type out base two is Again, quotation mark. Um, now I need to prompt, and we're going to call this variable C. And last, we have a third thing we need to ask for. So again, under program, display, alpha lock, and now we're going to ask for the height. So height. is and now we need to have the user input the height so prompt and we're going to call this variable h now we need to do the math so we're going to do two parentheses we're going to add the two bases so b plus c close parentheses divide by two and close parentheses again. And then for the program or the formula, we need to multiply that by the height. And once we put this formula in, we're gonna store that and we're just gonna store it to variable A. And now we're almost done. Last couple of steps, you're gonna go to program display and we're gonna do the alpha lock again and say area area of sometimes it takes me a second to find the letter trap uh, Z O I D area of a trapezoid and then we are going to go to program display and we're going to put the variable a because that's what we set it equal to. So now let me show you how it works. So uh, say I had a trapezoid um, I need to find the area of. So I'm going to go in here and go to area of a trapezoid. You hit enter to run the program again and then it's going to ask me for the base. So let's say one base is 10. We're going to say the other base is 20. Oh, and I made an error. So now I'm going to go to, oh, it's because I forgot the quotation mark here. Oh, alpha. All right, so now that was to show you how to troubleshoot. <laughs> so now let's try it again. So enter to run. We're going to say base one is 10, base two is 20. And we're going to say the height is five. 
And so the area of the trapezoid, let's just make the form, make sure the formula is right. You add the two bases, so 10 plus 20 is 30, divide by 2 is 15, and then 15 times 5 is the area of the trapezoid. There is your program, and you are all set.